of influencers. Okay, in general, what's the best way to uh, approach a girl? Best way to approach? Oh my god, a fact. Give her a fact. Just don't even introduce. Oh no, you know what? The best way to go approach a girl <laughs> is you go up to her, you don't say anything. You look her deep in the eye, you look down, lick your fingers, look back up. What's up? I love that move. You don't think that would work? If a guy came up to me and was like, what's up? I'd be like, can I buy you a drink? What, what are you drinking, whiskey? Let's get this guy a whiskey over here. Cause it's funny. Like, what the hell is this guy doing? That is fun. Don't come up to me and be like, hi, what's your name? Where are you from? What's going on? Like, be different. Don't be like everybody else. Come up and just like, give me a weird ass fact. Like, um, do you know that bananas used to have seeds? I would be like, what? That's crazy. What's your name? So I think the best approach is just being weird and different. So be fun. I don't know your, your, your fiance, but if he was a fitness model and he was uh, doing photo shoots with uh, girls, would you care or would you be bothered? No, honestly, it's all confidence. So if you're confident in yourself, you have nothing to worry about. I know what I'm worth. I know what's in here. It's not about my physical looks. I know what's up here. So I don't really care if he talks to other women, works with other women, fitness models. He could do a nude shoot if he wants to do something like that. He knows who he comes home to. Like He knows what my brain is like. And it's really hard to find something like that. You know when you come across someone that's different than everybody else. So when you know you're different, you don't have anything to be afraid of. So I don't really, I'm very confident in myself. So I don't think that would be a problem. Do you have any demands regarding your fiance? Oh, demands? Oh, let's see. Demands, demands. Oh, we both have, I'm trying to think. You know, demands in just a partner in general is that you you want to be happy with yourself because I think that's the key to a good relationship. Um, my only demand is that he is satisfied in his life. Don't let what I want or don't want change who you are because at the end of the day, you need to be happy as an individual. I demand you to be happy, please, because if you're not, it's going to come into the relationship. If you're unhappy, it'll come. We'll have issues. We'll fight. So as long as both of us are individually happy, we can come together and be a really happy couple together. So just demand personal satisfaction with your personal life. Follow the Moti on Instagram, Facebook, and Snapchat.